storm is coming. Mankind faces ruin and despair. The world is changing, yet hope remains in the hearts of the people. We go about our daily lives never knowing the forces that can change our destinies forever. We are oblivious, ignorant like sheep to the slaughter. This night, in the year of our Lord 1047, marks the beginning of our journey together. A journey into darkness, into madness. I watch him from the shadows. Is he the one? He has come far already, but he will be tested, tested to the very limits of human endurance and beyond. This night he rides looking for the old gods, armed with an amulet that has led him here. Tonight he will begin his journey into oblivion. What's up, you two? A beautiful introduction from my boy Patrick Stewart. But we're starting up Castlevania, Lords of Shadow. <sighs> I guess this is the line. These next three games are like the the last great Castlevanias. I enjoyed them when I played them back on 360. So I decided to revisit them on Steam. This this John threw us for the loop. Me, my brother Jay, everybody we knew that loved Castlevania, that grew up on Castlevania. So I'm deciding it to replay it again. Uh, I really don't remember much. I saw uh, a Castlevania 2 Vengeance trailer, which I burned when uh, Lords of Shadow 2 was coming out. And I was like, man, I'm, I, I got to replay this. So here we are. Let's get to it. Konami's one of Konami's last great before they fell into the motherfucking The struggle gutter. for supremacy is eternal, inevitable. Victory is the natural objective of every creature on this world. They will kill and die for their kind to dominate. Some call this eternal struggle equilibrium, the balance between light and darkness. These are dark times, times without hope. Men of faith claim that this is a test from God to strengthen our spirit. Perhaps this is true, or perhaps it is simply a pious lie. If it is true, darkness has come to engulf one's proud humanity, and we are witnessing the end. X for direct attacks, Y for area attacks, press A to jump, combine these together to unleash the deadliest motherfucking moves ever. This shit looks sick even back in the day, man. The help font. Wolfman Jack. Get these 
these daggers before they vanish. Press B to throw daggers. Dying. I eat those kids. Remember if there was a dodge button. When you kill an enemy, you gain experience points. Kill some enemies now to collect 25. There's a, like a parry button, if I remember. Alright, this is your travel book. Use it to buy new combat moves and abilities. Check your inventory and discover useful information about the Castlevania world and its inhabitants. Alright, so... Guillotine. Should I do? Well, I got basics. So let's... Okay. Give me those achievements, boy. I remember when we first played this, we were like, what the fuck, bro? Like, new character? Like, what is this? We had no idea what we were in for. I knew it. button is sticking though. Oh, I was I was holding the button. He kept attacking. Let's go, boy. Don't get scared. This shit still looks sick, bro. Yo, look at his face. He's like, this ain't shit to me. He just laid him down like, you know what? It is what it is, baby. Who? Who are you? I am Gabriel. I have traveled here seeking the Guardian of the Lake. You are from the Order? They sent you? How do I find him? He... He will find you. In the forest.
Mr. E. I follow him into the old forest, watching him from afar. He is strong indeed. The one God comes to drive out the many, but here, in this place, God's influence is thin and threadbare. The old gods still hold sway here. Few venture this far into the wood. He is disturbed by dreams, dreams that gnaw at his very soul. He will rest for the night, but rest will not come easy. The battle has left him weakened, but he knows the dream will return, and though he fears nothing on this earth, yet his nightmares sap the strength within him and leave a cold grip on his heart. Tomorrow he will use the old hunting path. Long has it been in disuse, but for now he dreams. What motivates a man to confront the challenges that most of us would run from? Condemning him to solitude, exposing him to defeat and death. The answer is love, a force so powerful that all reason becomes blind to it, blind to all things, even the truth. Loss of love can make a man desperate, desperate enough to do anything to bury the truth, to hide from its pain. Totally forgot about this. Another big dog. Press X to attack wargs. Press Y to attack Lycanthorpe riders. Both attacks can be aimed left or right. Dodge. Press and hold LT and push the left stick to either side. Okay. Okay, let's get trashed. Be yeah, I definitely got to get a, a controller, man. Stop jumping on me, motherfucker. That's the parry. have to be facing it.
I was that. That's, that's kind of hard to dodge. That's not the attack. Damn it. The thing is, you can't turn the camera around either. weird when you can't change the camera. Travel no further. You will find what you seek ahead. <laughs> what movie had a scene like that? This trademark sliding. his thoughts as company, he continues on his journey to find the one he seeks. Who or what was that strange creature? There is a power here that few know, a power that could have some influence on events. Perhaps the guardian of the lake is aware of him now and offers aid in his quest. There is just the small matter of the dead bog to overcome, a place that has claimed the lives of many of the Brotherhood. The smell of death is strong here, and danger lies around every corner, but nothing will stop him. Nothing will stand in his way. All right. All right. My 
life gem down. These are usually worn by warriors of the Brotherhood of Light. Magical gems can be inserted into empty slots. And be the wear with increased stamina. When all five slots are filled, the green gems, the life bar's capacity is increased. Gotcha. There is something in the water, something terrible. I have seen men dragged under, never to return. The location of these treasures, these creatures can only be seen as ripples or bubbles on the surface. I surmise one must wait for these ripples and bubbles to disappear before progressing through the bog. One cannot walk around them because noxious fumes lay either side of the safe path, so one must be patient and wait for the right moment to cross over them. Heck. I know I'm going to die, but at least it will be, I will be fighting not swallowed by any of those mire fiends. Okay. Some traversal. the bubbles damn somebody threw a grenade really bro we can throw it back at him Close and press RT to get it. Okay, he throws it automatically. Out, son. Oh no, that's too uh So I can't just walk the spot. I gotta get close. What? What'd you say? I don't think I'm gonna I don't think I'm gonna make it. Okay. You got time with the bubbles. It always feels like somebody's watching me. Okay. So that's the, there's a treasure up there, isn't there? Please don't pop up. Oh wait, I thought there was a, a thing here. Let me go back down and get this shit. Bro, but can he just jump? Or can we jump?
We can. But we'd rather do it the old school way. Hmm. That's that's dangerously close. All right, easy clap. That really didn't look like a health font. It looked like blue. Grenade. Oh, he ate that in blue. Okay, okay. All right. We can do that. There's fucking two of them. That should be enough time to make it. Let's just get a little closer. Decisions, decisions. This might go back to the other path. If I should try jumping over it, over the first one. Move it, move it. That was luck. I should be able to walk through it. That's a big long one too. <clears throat> Let's 
I don't think that one disappears. Can I go around it? I don't think I can. I think I have to go squeeze through there when it gets smaller. So I'm looking at the upper path. So wait, can I? All right, let's just wait a little bit. Get in my way. Ouch. Fuck that. No, it's not. That's probably another path you can come through. Man, there's more of this shit. Alright, so can I go left? There's a mausoleum here in the bog that has lain undisturbed for many years. Cardinal Volp, or Volpi, informs me that the legendary artisan Renardo Gandolfi constructed a powerful relic there during his so, what's that a J sojourn, which will aid the one that wields the combat cross. I must admit, I'm apprehensive. Many of my comrades lie dead along the way, and I'm wandering. I'm wondering if this fool's errand will be the end of me too. Alright, so it's definitely not that way.
Please disappear. Thank you. Shit, you can sink in this John too? Redunculus. Oh no! Wait, there is a path to go over there, right? Or is it the same way? I almost done killed myself. He tried to get a freebie. doesn't do anything unless I need a health is this the mother Like motherfucker going in my crib. Forgive me, brother, but my need is far greater than yours. And I love his voice actor, man. It fits him, it fits the character. skills have been unlocked. This relic was also built by a renowned artisan, Renardo Gandolfi. The articulated metal tip... Is that what that says? Yeah, the articulated metal cup. What the fuck? I got a little mosquito crawling on my screen right where I'm reading. This shit is stupid. I can't swing at the TV. He knows. He knows. And enemies from a distance, giving the combat cross the properties of a grappling hook. This also allows the wielder to climb, repel, and swing around environments when combined with the combat cross. Okay. Move closer to use that. Press X. I gotta get used to the, the L trigger. Because my L trigger stays stuck sometimes.
See what I mean? Get stuck. Oh, he tried to combo me? I'm gonna see if I can block one of his attacks. Yep. Okay, bro. Anything else around here? It just feels so weird when you play games like this and you can't control the camera. Okay, Hope hopefully I can go back. <clears throat> hopefully I don't bust my ass. Over the ledge, and April will grab on. Get that. can't jump back. Hmm. <laughs> 